This is the last uh, beaver video for 2012. I've done all I can and I'm going to do to uh, put the land back to normal at least for the end of this year. So anyway, you're looking at what used to be the beaver pond and if you looked at my other videos you'll see various work, uh, pieces of work that I did to kind of clear things up. But at any rate, it's all relatively level. Uh, grass has grown up. Uh, there's some humps and bumps in places but the beavers are gone. The dam uh, which was all along here is all gone and uh, right now you're looking uh, across my corduroy road which I had to use to build and use to get to uh, the part of the dam uh, that's just beyond the edge of the grass there uh, to remove that. Now I'm just at the edge of the corduroy road which is all overgrown with grass now and I'm moving toward the main uh, creek bed carefully there and this is the creek bed and uh, you can see the creek flowing there and there's a culvert that I've added right here and so this whole area is now uh, the, the creek goes through here on this culvert and this all this material that was holes and dam is now gone and uh, filled back in so that hopefully uh, beavers don't see a great opportunity to gain a lot of ground by making a pond. Um, we'll see what happens. But at any rate, so here's another kind of a shot across what used to be the beaver pond and fortunately isn't anymore. Now also, uh, the last thing I want to comment on is the uh, culvert here uh, now uh, provides me an area where I can drive my tractor so uh, I can go to the other side of the woods by just kind of following this path right here and in the spring I'll go past the neighbor's deer stand and I'll be able to uh, go into that part of the woods which I haven't been able to get to for a number of years. In the spring also there's some dam material left over there and as soon as things dry up in the spring I'll get over there and move that material because there are areas that are low where I just ran out of dirt this year uh, but I'll fill that in next year. So that's it. It's 55 degrees on the 3rd of December and uh, I'm standing right on top of, well now I am, right on top of the creek. Uh, see you next spring.